What's up, everybody? It's your boy Meme here. I just took a shower. Uh, you know, while I was on the treadmill, I was watching um, uh, Facebook Connect 2021, although I suppose it'll be called Meta Connect. Um, and I find it really interesting because they were talking about, you know, the metaverse, right? And uh, I kind of, kind of, I find it kind of freaky how um, instead of something like this theoretical metaverse, right, which is this 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 whole Connect presentation was them basically just advertising what the future might look like and why you should invest in them. Right? Uh, I stole the floss. Bear it back. I'm back. Uh, I gave the floss back. Why does it look like that? Oh my god! It looks like I have a massive. It looks like I have a massive eyebrow that's just a shadow from my glasses. Um, anyways, so, yeah, I just thought it was really, really interesting. Uh, I don't think that... That looks so bad. Hold on. Okay, that's better. No, it's not. Okay, I, I guess you're just gonna have to live with that shadow. Um, yeah, I found it very interesting. Uh, but I kind of find it kind of freaky how this, you know, inevitable metaverse, right, uh, is going to be owned by Facebook instead of owned by nobody and just being open source. And, you know, I think that's kind of not an amazing business model. I think in the future, it's definitely going to be open source. I can't possibly imagine people are going to. You know, I'm sure people said this about privacy back before 9-11, but we, we saw it happen. But I, that looks so bad. I'm just going to take off my glasses for now. Um, it's it's the angle the light's coming from. It just it just makes it look bad. Um, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm sure people said that about privacy like pre 9 11 right but we saw how that turned out but i can't possibly imagine people will want um meta to be you know controlling literally their lives right because you know this is becoming people's reality this, this vr stuff is probably gonna become my reality when valve makes a new headset and uh i can't really imagine that's a very good business model uh, because a lot of people are just never going to buy into it uh, you know, and I suppose they're kind of trying to cater to the more, um, lack of a better word, normie audience, right? And they're looking more into, you know, to do, to less attract people in the VR space and to more attract people in the, in the reality space. People who, like, don't care about that stuff. Um, and I suppose that's pretty noble, and I suppose those people won't really care too much about meta owning it, but, uh, still. That's pretty annoying. Uh, however, I must say the Facebook connection logo looks crazy. It just looks so amazing um, You know, that's like one of the only good pieces of design work that Facebook has done or or meta now uh, Yeah, it's not even Facebook anymore. That is the first and only and last uh, good piece of design that they ever did uh, Yeah, all right. Uh, see you dude. Oh for breakfast. I had um, I had biscuits and gravy. My mom made biscuits and gravy for lunch. I had a coke trying to stop drinking soda because I realized uh you know people always people <laughs> people always joke about like oh alcohol you know destroying your liver but here's the crazy thing I realized uh everything that's not water destroys your liver right that's the whole thing and so you got to um the thing you got to do is you got to um realize that you should just drink water and everything else is kind of bad for you uh except for maybe sparkling water maybe right but I don't know that's I don't know um and so, I'm trying to stop drinking Coke, but it's kind of weird because uh, I try to stop drinking Coke, I feel like I need a, I need a Coca-Cola, you know? Maybe it's caffeine. Maybe I'm just so used to the caffeine of the Coke that, uh, you know, I just can't stop drinking it. Uh, but yeah, I'm trying to stop drinking Coke, but I had a Coke for lunch. Uh, and for dinner, we have beef stroganoff, which sounds fancy. It's just beef and noodles and mushrooms. It's very good. Um, it's quite rich though. Uh, it, it wasn't a homemade recipe. It was, my mom usually does homemade, she you, she usually has a recipe from online and just over the years perfects it, right? She's done that with her pizza, she's done that with, uh, with her lasagna, she's done that with her chicken pot pie, she's done that with her meat pie. Uh, but you know, since it's a new recipe, she just got it straight from online. And uh, we say, you know, she thinks that once she starts making it from scratch, it would be way tastier because it was good, but you know, it was a little bit too rich. And uh, you know, don't get me wrong, very good food, but you know, uh, she she thinks it could, it could be better, right? Which, uh, you know, I suppose I agree with. Um, here's another thing. I'm thinking about maybe getting into writing. Not creative writing. I'm not going to write fiction because I know I can't do that. Uh, no joke. I can, somebody can ask me to talk about something for 48 hours or like I die. I could do that easily. I'll, I'll never die. I could talk for 96 hours about anything, right? Uh, and it won't even seem like I'm just 
riffing and talking for no reason. I, I, I just have a lot of thoughts, and the more I talk, the more thoughts I have, and so it just kind of builds up exponentially, right? Uh, and so I think, I don't know, maybe I'll start typing these things out online and posting them. Uh, but it will not be under my name, and it won't be under a paywall. I, 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 I need this, f I, I think I might do this for me, right? Um, because I think it would be rather interesting. Um, yeah. And it won't even be anything interesting, it'll be like, like, four pages about what the theoretical best size of like a Wi-Fi card in like a Latitude E-Series laptop would be, you know? Uh, which is something I've talked about for like 30 minutes before and I could totally stretch it out into like four pages if I wanted to. Uh, which, I, I have four pages of things to talk about about Latitude E-Series Wi-Fi cards, okay? Don't get me started on those. Um, yeah, and for yeah, dinner we had beef strobe. Oh, today's Halloween? Uh, we're not really celebrating this today, uh, because, you know, COVID, all those kids blowing in your face. Uh, even though I'm at school all the time, uh, but, you know, you might as well do what you get. Um, grab the choices you have to not get COVID, right? Uh, and also, uh, we just decided not to. Uh, you know, it's none of our super favorite holidays, so... You know, I think the reason why all of us like Christmas so much is because, uh, now this is between you and me, we don't give presents to anybody outside of our, outside of anybody living in this house, right? Which is, like, me and, like, my family. Uh, and that's, like, three people, right? Uh, so I don't think, um, a lot of people hate Christmas because it's so stressful when you have to get your friends presents. Uh, life hack, uh, Sigma, Sigma male grinds out tip, uh, just don't give them presents, uh, and then it won't be stressful. Um, just give them money. Just, uh, I don't know, cash out them something. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> maybe give them an NFT, right? Who knows? Maybe, maybe they're a big crypto nerd. Maybe they just love destroying the environment and they, they just gotta, they just gotta have that new crypto punk, you know? Uh, all right. Let's see, dude. I'm gonna put on my glasses now. I have that weird shadow from the sun make it look like I have the longest eyebrows in the world. Uh, I've been recording for seven minutes. That's just a testament to how long I can speak, I suppose. All right, see you, dude.